Hey Scorpio, welcome back guys. So let's go ahead and see what's coming towards you guys this week in love. Let's see what is your overall energy for the week. Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians, what's coming towards my Scorpio in love this week? Guys, please keep in mind that these readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does and leave the rest behind. Also, time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot, guys. Reverse the roles as need be. Don't forget to check your sun, your moon, your rising, and Venus signs for additional messages and clarity regarding their situation. So let's go ahead and see. What is the overall energy for my Scorpio? Universe, archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. Somebody's dealing with an Aries because I keep on hearing Aries. So you might be dealing with the fire sign. What is the overall energy here, universe? You got mending. Unfinished business. So this person's going to come back towards you, Scorpio. Okay. I was about to say again, Aries. Okay. I feel for some of you guys, you might be dealing with an Aries. Okay. But there's something about them wanting to meet up with you. Community here. Um, there's some unfinished business between you and this person. It's just a matter of time before this person comes back towards you. You may have at one point viewed this person as your yin and you were their yang. Okay. But there's this energy of exchanging gifts, exchanging communications, and speaking a truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. To the sea. So this person, I feel, is um, more closer than what you think, okay? They're already planning this forward movement here. They keep on going around and around whether or not to send you this message, okay? But they will be willing to go to distance for you. Time for a nap. I feel like this person has been holding back because they've really been contemplating this connection and what's been going on between you and them. And there's this, it's just a matter of time before they communicate with you, okay? To the sea, um, I'm really getting that this person has to travel quite a bit possibly to come towards you. You guys may live quite a distance away from each other, but there's something about them wanting to bring you a gift, okay? And this TikTok, it's a matter of time. I really do feel like there's a matter of time here because they want to resolve this situation with you. I feel like this person is not at peace without you. Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What happened in the recent past here between my Scorpio and the person that's on their mind? What happened in the recent past? You got the Emperor. I told you guys you're dealing with an Aries. Because the Emperor is an Aries. Okay? So you are definitely dealing with a fire sign energy here. But I feel when this person came into your life in the recent past, it was full of passion. It was full of love, seduction, uh, stability. Look it. Again, a fire sign. It was a very... Yeah, you guys are definitely dealing with the fire sign Scorpio here. You felt like you have met the one, two of cups energy. The one that you were meant to be with. The one that you were meant to grow old with. The one that was going to be your everything. Okay? Somewhere along the line, problem started with the nine of wands energy here. Okay? There could have very well been a death in the situation or a death in the family, but something changed. Something transformed here. Now, maybe someone's past came back around here trying to heal the situation with them and this caused problems. Or someone from their past that had children with them, their kids were possibly acting out or causing problems. But there was something that changed majorly in this connection. What happened in the recent past universe? Yeah, look, I see five of wands. So I feel that there was some interference. Someone's ex came back. Someone who they had children with possibly tried to come back and reconcile something here with them. And with the judgment, somebody made a decision. Either that person made a decision to continue pursuing your person or your person just made a decision to go back to their ex. Okay. And with the seven of pentacles here, I do got to be honest with you. I feel like they made the wrong decision. Okay. Because this person is just staring off wondering what did they do why did they do it why would they do it what is this current energy here between scorpio and the person that's on their mind universe the knight of wands energy and the high priestess so scorpio intuitively you know that this person is about to get ready to communicate with you you're starting to see the signs for some of you guys you're starting to see a lot of synchronicities a lot of um Signs that remind you of this person with the artist is like there's something that this person did or or gave you that constantly reminds you of them. But I do feel like there's something that's about to change here. What's going on, universe here? 
Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. So someone's coming back offering you this stable new beginning here. Okay. Six of Pentacles wanting to have an equal give and take with you. All right. Eight of Cups energy regretting walking away from you. Now they view you as an empress. Okay. This person views you as their better half. They started as an emperor and we're ending here with an empress. So now they want to give you some type of stability here. They want to communicate. They want to conversate. They want to clear things up with you. What is this overall energy? What is this person's intentions with my Scorpio? Justice to make things right with you. Okay. To clear the air with you. To fix things with you. The temperance. To bring peace, harmony, and balance to this connection. To potentially reconcile and reunite with you. What else, universe? The five of pentacles. To bring their... To, for you to allow them back in from out of the cold. This person wants to way back into your life, into your heart. And into your world. Page of Swords energy. So, uh, Scorpio, definitely expect communication here from this person. I do feel like they're about to get ready to reach out to you. King of Cups energy. They're going to pour their heart out to you. Okay. Five of Swords energy. They do have a lot of remorse and regret for allowing people to interfere in this connection. They want a second opportunity here with the Wheel of Fortune. They're coming towards you with real, real commitment this time. For some of you guys, you're going to get a ring right away. What is the possible outcome in this situation, universe, archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians? The three of swords and the magician. So for some of you guys, you manifested this person back when your heart was broken, when you were going through a lot, and here they come. This is going to bring you in a lot of happiness with the sun. This king of pentacles is going to come towards you very stable and abundant. With the Ten of Pentacles offering real deal offers here with you, okay? It might have taken them a while here with the Hermit, but here they come with the Six of Swords because they want to travel towards you. They want to have a conversation with you. They want to move forward with you, okay? Now, for some of you guys, you may look at this person when they come back to you as a burden because they betrayed your trust in the past, but the truth of the matter is that this person is free from that situation and no longer plans to continue dealing with that person or that other situation or that interference that once occurred. What are the final messages here for my Scorpio universe? The Queen of Wands energy. So their attention is going to be all on you and only you. No one else but you. Okay. You have the King and the Queen of Wands on the table. You also have the Emperor and the Empress. This is a very passionate connection. And this person wants to come back towards you because they want to mend this relationship. Seven of Wands energy. They're ready to fight for it. They're ready for, to fight for it. Even if you possibly have started dating, they're ready to fight the person that you're starting to date. What is the advice here for my, uh, my Scorpio? What is the advice for Scorpio universe? Engagement and let go of control issues. So I feel like this person is wanting to come towards you. They do want to offer engagement. There is something about you guys struggling with control issues that may ultimately cause a red flag for you in this situation. But the truth of the matter is that I do feel like this person has changed, okay? They do want to pursue this connection in a better energy. They're hoping for you to forgive them. They also want to show you that they've learned some lessons in this separation. And they want you to give this relationship another chance, okay? So you are being asked to keep an open mind here. If you do try to want or if you do attempt to move forward with this person... Be open-minded about the situation. Yes, there was a lot that went on in the past, but you guys do have an opportunity to reunite this connection. Just trust this process here, okay? Because this is true love for you and this person, okay? I do feel like you guys are finally going to have that fair share now. All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if anyone is interested in a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.